Good morning, everyone. I just made some matcha. Very, very proud of myself. Also, guys, just like look how beautiful this is. Ignore that one candle. I still haven't even gotten the candles for these, but it's so pretty. Good morning, everyone. My battery is still sitting there. You guys know the drill. Um, I'm gonna eat my breakfast, drink matcha. Coffee's been a little heavy in the morning, so I decided to switch to matcha. Um, I have some water, and then I'm gonna do my morning reading. Officially good morning. Um, it is like 10.30. I just did my reading. I need to go um, right now at my studio, actually. My studio, guys. Um, is set up in my closet. Also, I'm wearing my workout clothes because I change into these immediately when I get up in the morning. Makes it really easy to actually go work out and it makes me work out. I haven't vlogged in like a week because honestly, it was a very bad week for me as we established in the last vlog. But I am back. My flashlight is on. How did that happen? Anyways, I'm back. We're gonna vlog. I'm gonna record the intro for this week's podcast. It's actually a really good one. I'm really excited. I don't know. I said actually, they're all really good, obviously. Can you guys tell I miss vlogging? I'm kind of going crazy. So, I'm gonna record this intro, send it over to Taylor, my producer, and then I think I'm gonna work out. I've been doing the Melissa Wood Health stuff. Love it. Big fan. Okay, so product-wise, I've actually found some new products that I really, really love. Most of these will be in the email, but I'm just gonna share one with you right now. The Super Glow Glow Screen. Oh my gosh, this stuff is so amazing. It just makes your skin look so healthy and pretty. It has this nice tint. All right, so that took a lot longer than I thought because I actually had three ads and I haven't had, like I normally don't have three ads. So I feel like all my vlogs right now are literally the same. So I'm so sorry. Um, I have a drunk elephant like haul to do for you guys. But um, tomorrow's episode, for those of you guys who really want more like faith content and stuff, that is the episode that you guys have been asking for basically gotta give the people what they want you know anyways obviously like this isn't gonna just be like a faith-based podcast but a lot of you guys have been requesting that so i thought i would just share even if you're like not into that sort of thing i think it's kind of encouraging and kenzie's really cute so anyways it's 11 20 now i don't know how i spent so much time in here already i think i'm gonna go downstairs I'm i might do a melissa wood health workout which i've really been liking all right, so I'm gonna choose my melissa wood health workout i've actually been really liking this i know i said I think I said in the vlog recently that I didn't want to keep paying subscriptions, but I've actually really loved this. And I think that something about paying for something monthly, it's only $10 a month, but paying for something monthly makes me actually work out and use it from home. That's why I am with like, if I get an unlimited membership at a studio, I'm way more likely to go because I'm already paying for it. So I find that I'm more likely to do this than I am to do like a free Instagram live thing, which I know is not like the smartest financial advice. I mean, it's only $10 a month, but that's just what's really helped me stay motivated working out at home. I actually like it when I do it, but getting me to do it is a lot harder. So anyways, she has a new workout that I think I might do. I don't have one pound weights yet. I've been waiting for my weights. I actually ordered two pounds, which now I'm like, should I have just ordered one, you know? But okay, so I think I'm going to do this one. Here's my workout after the day, slippers and all, and then my lemon mat. So I'll talk to you guys after. My hair looks great. All right, guys, I just finished my workout. Ugh, it just like... There is something about the Melissa Wood Health workouts, and I know so many people are talking about it right now because everyone's working out from home, but I'm normally someone who likes, what is on my lip, what the heck? I'm normally someone who likes like listening to SoundCloud rap and it has to be so loud and like my workouts just being like, intense and very opposite vibe of hers, but I actually love them. I find them like so relaxing. Sorry, there's stuff on my coffee table. They're just so relaxing and I work out and it's a really good workout and then I just feel so good after. Like, cannot recommend it enough. So anyways, I'm gonna go put laundry away, shower, get ready. It's like 12.16. Q and I have some plans for today, which I'm excited for. My friend started a book club. So I wanna get on that Zoom call because I miss all my friends. I really like, really, 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 really miss my friends in LA now, especially cause like I can't really even see anyone here. But yeah, I've been like, I just FaceTime Taylor and she didn't respond to me the first, the first time ever. And she's going to be like, shut up because she FaceTimes me like every day and I never respond because normally my phone's in the other room. And if I text back, I'm on my laptop. So then people think I have my phone and then I don't have FaceTime on my laptop. So that's where we're at. So anyways, I'll also I'm going to make a recipe book. So we're running upstairs and do laundry and then we'll get going. Okay guys, well, first off, oh my gosh, I haven't even showed you my new chair. Here's my new chair, it's from Article. It is the cutest chair ever, I'm absolutely obsessed with it. Um, I will have it linked down below, but I just think it's so cute. So anyways, 
here is my bed, all of our normal stuff. Hopefully I'll have the new nightstand soon and then all of this will just be better. But my rug is supposed to come in today, which has made it way cozier. This room is just getting cozier and that's kind of the goal. I am now wishing I would have gotten a way taller bed, honestly, but for now, this will do. And then also, I'm gonna take all these off and spray paint them white so that they'll be back to white. Also, this dresser is just like literally the worst quality, but it is what it is for now, guys. We have all that, then I'm gonna have my rug, and then we'll have another one there and everything will just be better. But anyways, um, oh, first I wanted to show you guys my drunk elephant box. So I got two boxes from them. One was just of my favorite skincare stuff. I really want to try some retinol. This is one of their newer-ish products, the retinol cream. It's not new by any means, but it wasn't like their first launch, I don't think. This is my all-time favorite drunk elephant oil. Um, this is like my one of my skincare holy grails. It's so good. Then we just have a moisturizer. We have the normal um, sunscreen, and I gave Q a few things, so anyways, the newest launch, this is really exciting and also very convenient for me because I actually just ran out of my shampoo and conditioner, and obviously, like, we can't really go to the store, or we're not going to the store as much right now, so there's body cleanser, shampoo and conditioner, this is a scalp scrub, which is awesome, a body lotion I'm so excited for, this is a little tangle spray, there's a deodorant right here. Um, this is really cool. It's like a dry brush, but obviously it is, I think, silicone, right? So if you guys are familiar with dry brushing, I haven't done it a ton, but I've always wanted to. They have that, um, I feel like I'm forgetting things. They sent me a robe, which I'm really excited for, and then a comb, some hair things, and yeah, that's really cool. But I'm really excited. Drunk Elephant is honestly one of my favorite brands, so I'm really excited. Alright guys, I just showered. I forgot to lose, what? I forgot to use the lotion. I used the cleanser and it felt so good. I didn't wash my hair um, because I just didn't need to, but um, I feel good. I FaceTimed TK and since we're on FaceTime, I just ended up doing a full, I mean, this is not, would this be a full face of makeup? You know what I mean? Like to find a full face of makeup, because when I think full face makeup, I think like Desi Perkins snatched. But I put on a little bit of makeup um, for the day. So anyways, it is 1.08 p.m. I want to sit down. I'm actually really hungry, but I have literally no food. We have to go to the grocery store. Um, I really want to sit down and make my recipe book. These are the things I get excited for now, guys. So since I get asked about this literally all the time and I've answered it so many times, my Q necklace is from the M Jewelers, just so everyone knows. And he got it for me for Christmas. So... It should still be up, I'm assuming, I mean, it's only been a few months. They literally always have sales too. What is the business model where you always have sales? Like a Boohoo or, I'm in business school, why am I forgetting this? Like Misguided, which is what always gets me, which is why I made four orders in the past month. I mean, it's on sale. Actually though, I'll take the Misguided sweats, I really love them. Why can't I get this to work? So, I really need to make my recipe book so I know what I'm eating today, so I can make my grocery list. I'm really hungry as I do this, so it's just really bad timing. I also need my um, hoops, you know? All right, so I just made some apples and peanut butter for my snack, and guys, I'm so mad. Well, first off, Coco. I will never forgive you for this. This is my holy grail product, and look what she did to it. But my apple pen has gone missing. I brought it in my I put it in a bag and like all of a sudden it's gone missing also look at these slippers these are 20 on Amazon these are 30 I'll have the link down below but I needed my pen to make the journal perfect so that's really unfortunate hopefully it turns up it could only be in two like two bags and those are just gone and I've literally bought like three apple pens I'm so over myself all right everyone so it is 2 30 I don't know why my eyes keep wandering so bad I'm actually just like in bed on my laptop and I was working on some recipes, but I think we actually aren't gonna go grocery shopping today. So um, I think I haven't really ordered food in. Honestly, I've pretty much eaten or I pretty much cooked every meal that I've had since being in quarantine. And I also really do wanna support like restaurants and businesses, but I just don't like, I know everyone's doing it, but for some reason to me, it's like kind of scary. So I think we're gonna do that today. But um, it's 2.30, I haven't had coffee yet, and I normally can go without coffee and I'm fine. I think I just also haven't had enough water. My hydrofloss is right there, I'm gonna get that. Um, but I'm so tired. I'm also laying in bed, so like what do I expect, you know? But anyways, um, 
I seriously just like love my room right now so much and it's gonna only just get better my rug was supposed to arrive yesterday but I just got an email that it got shipped today so that'll be here soon which will really I think pull it together and then I really do want to get a plant I'm not a huge plant person I understand I need a plant whatever I'm gonna get a plant that nightstand will be done and then also like I really want honestly this looks so bad on camera but I really want like a full length mirror which I don't really have room for but I, part of me wants to do a plant there and then just do like a small full length mirror because I just need another photo, another place for outfit photos for Instagram. I know that's so freaking annoying guys. Like I, I know, I know. Um, but I've been trying to just like watch some YouTube videos and I did get a few recipes on the Melissa Wood Health website, which I'm excited for. And then I just paid some bills and stuff online, but yeah, that's what we're doing. All right guys, I really need to go make myself some coffee now. So I think I'm gonna head downstairs, but also before I forget, I wanted to mention that me, um, who all, there's a bunch of us doing Keaton, Danielle, Natalie, Katie, Morgan, Michelle, Brooke, I feel like I've said everyone, but um, we're doing a big giveaway on Instagram on Saturday, so if you guys, I mean obviously I know a lot of you guys have been affected, I mean pretty much everyone has been affected by COVID-19, but especially financially, um, go follow my Instagram, just at Kenzie Elizabeth, and then you guys will be able to see on Saturday um, the giveaway, which I'm really excited for. We're all really excited for it. So, just wanted to mention it. Oh my gosh, Coco's literally such a drama queen. She just lays like this. Oh my gosh, side eye. Oh, you're so cute. Hi, everyone. It is now, aw, all that matters came on. It is now, the that's so loud, 3.38. Quentin and I are about to do an Instagram Live in two minutes. I finally have my first cup of coffee of the day. My eyes are watering. Normally, when I don't have caffeine, I'm actually okay. Like, I've had it to where I'll get a headache or something, but now I'm like, you know, so. I'm drinking a lot of water. Quentin's texting, which takes his full undivided attention. Every single time. He's very serious about his texts. Go, go, it's time. It's important. Words matter, you know? There are so many words in the English language. Why? Because you got to pick the right ones in order to accurately communicate oh in a concise and precise manner how you're feeling. Mm -hmm. Yep. Well, are you ready to go live? Yeah. Okay, we're going live on Instagram. Follow us both. So, it is currently, I think it's like 6 p.m. Um, I don't remember the last time I vlogged. I think when we did an Instagram live. Is that when I vlogged us? Mm -hmm. I think yeah. so. Quentin just took a nap. He's really tired. Neither of us are... Um, late night people lately though i've been going to bed a lot later like midnight or one which i normally don't do i actually go to bed at 9 p.m like if i have no plans if quentin is home and i have no plans i literally go to bed at 8 p.m keo is like really loving coco today she's matching your outfit this is a cuddly coco cuddly coco they're different sides to coco yeah you just have to catch her on a good day you know okay so we're gonna watch tiger king um Wait, yeah, Tiger King, right? Yeah. Why? I don't know when I said that. It felt so weird. Um, so I'm currently on episode two. Quentin is on episode one. He started watching it and then he fell asleep, so I switched to Nashville. Um, I'm like midway through season five, which is sad because there's only six seasons. Um, but we will do a little Tiger King recap when we're done watching for the night. He's really just having the time of his life. <laughs> Q, do you have a life update for the vlog or anything? Um, no. I didn't have a dream while I was napping, so nothing really updating. Just, you know, playing with Coco. Make sure if you're quarantining and you've got a dog, you've got to play with them. They what? deserve it. Coco, I literally spend every waking... I mean, I normally spend so much time with Coco, but I spend every waking second with her now, so... She's hopefully loving this. Oh my gosh, the attention is really just getting her anyways like i was saying we're not night owls so i stayed up late last night and i'm just like so actually tired and i also didn't have coffee till 4 p.m because i thought huh, i thought that matcha could do it I, just, I knew better but you know when you wake up and you're just like not in the mood for coffee i just keep talking for no reason you know well you don't drink coffee anymore but, like some mornings yeah, i wake I up and like i want Celsius. some mornings i wake up and i'm like craving coffee and then this morning, the thought of coffee is just not it. So, okay, we're gonna watch Tiger King. You match my Barefoot Dreams blankets. I know, I'm very inspired. Nude is in, I'm very about it. And I really like RJ, it's a really cool brand. And also, 
Kinsey's friend Keaton inspired me. The new also, also, no way. <laughs> also, Brandon's fits inspire me. They're kind of like they're kind of out there. <laughs> they're literally gonna. I'm not even gonna tell her that we said this. She's gonna actually die. I mean, I was like looking at some of his hoodie pant combinations. <laughs> I respect it. I'm not gonna lie. I've been taking some risks. And uh, you know, he works for Adidas, right? Oh yeah, no, I. Um, I forget I, you guys I, DM. Um, yeah, I posted a pic and it was with my Ultra Boost. <laughs> or no, no, my Alpha Bounce, and he was like fire, and I was like. I appreciate you. Those are some of my favorite kids. <laughs> I appreciate They're so you. comfy. But, um, nah, his uh, fashion risks <laughs> inspired me. This is a time mm-hmm. in your quarantine nobody can see. You can try out some, like, crazy fits out. So. Oh, wow. Great. All right, guys. We ended up doing a little pharmacy run, and then we picked up a few things while we were there. Mm-hmm. You recording? <laughs> yeah. Wash your hands. <laughs> ba, 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 ba. Have you seen those things on Twitter? Where yeah, like, what song do you sing? I don't really sing a song. Sometimes I'll just go through my ABCs in my head, though. Not often. ABCs. But I just like to get a nice lather going. Cute, I'm just trying to film. True. And I'm trying to stay alive. Alright. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> you know, I think Brandon said it the best. Wash your hands. YA. Stay inside. Okay, so we picked up a few things. Well, I picked up a few things. So did Quentin, but different things. So we have a um, pizza for tonight. We haven't even started watching Tiger King yet, guys. It's literally 8 p.m. So, okay. I got white cheddar cheese its because these sounded really good. Oh, you guys will be so proud of me. So on the live today, so many of you guys are telling me that I need to make the TikTok coffee, the whipped is it 425 or 450? Let me check for you really quick. Um, it's 400. Okay, so so many of you guys are saying that I need to make the TikTok whipped coffee. So I am gonna make it. I don't have sugar, so I got sugar. And then um, this instant coffee. Never used this before, but everyone's like raving about this coffee. So I will be making that on my TikTok, which is just Conceals with Hay. Go follow me. Um, lint rollers because. Quentin cannot survive without the rollers, and then I just got kind bars. So I've been hungry, and we haven't really. My coach used to tell me in soccer, "Look good, feel good, feel good, play good, play good, they pay good." Lint roller. Essentially, if you feel good while you're in quarantine, you're gonna feel all better. If you look good, you right know, now so like, he's like the parent in Fairly All Parents, where you can't see his head. Or like on uh, was it Cow and Chicken or like Dexter's? Do you say laboratory or do you say laboratory? Lavoratory. Oh, wow. We're making a DiGiorno. It's not delivery, it's DiGiorno. So, Ladies and gentlemen, yeah. boys and girls. Okay, they like that voice, you know? Guys, should, um, Quentin's actually, well, Quentin's pretty much good at everything that he tries to do, or he does, but he's actually really good at singing. Um, and he now has a piano that's still at my house right now. Q, maybe you should do covers now. This is how tired I am. I could, but... I would definitely do it at my place because you would get sick of me singing. Because I, would I do different arrangements and stuff. <laughs> well, okay. This thing was a good idea. What are you guys doing? What are some of your hobbies? I want to pick up a new hobby. I considered knitting, but I just don't think it's my vibe. I just don't know what to do. I need to get white spray paint to do my knot, like the things that I talked about earlier in the vlog. Um, it felt really weird leaving the house for a second. That was like really something. Okay guys, I've decided that I need to grab makeup off because I just don't know what it is. Like, I feel like maybe I'm just not getting good sleep. That's what Quentin was saying too. He feels like he's not getting good sleep either. I feel like no one in this world is getting good sleep. Um, I normally don't have sleeping problems, but I have been like waking up. Anyways, two nights ago, I didn't sleep much. And so they always say it's like not the next day, but the next day that it hits you. So I'm just powering through. All right, guys, we're making the pizza right now, but I'm trying to finish this little corner. I, that's someone else's package anyway, so it doesn't matter. But this little corner over here, I need an entry table. There's not that much space. And then I need a little basket because I would put my yoga mat in there because I do my at-home workouts right here. And then I'm going to put those frames on top of it and then figure it out from there. So I've been looking at Target online. I'm really just looking for fun right now. I like this basket. I really like this basket, too. Um, but I'm just trying to figure it out. Quentin just serenaded me. It was so good. 
but now he's insecure, so. Huh? Are you listening to me? Yeah. That's all you have to say? Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Actually, I really like this table, which is normally not necessarily my vibe. I feel like this is more typical house home. I don't know, you know what I'm saying? But I actually really like this. And then, but I don't know. I can't make my decision. Let me know what you guys think. I'm not in a rush to order anything, but I probably want to. Thanks, cute. Oh yeah, this is a cute Where's setup. And my purse, just like the lip addict lip gloss. So. Oh, no, it's the spicy one. <laughs> it's not spicy. Well, Guys, I've said this in a vlog. We've definitely told a story, right? Eh? Quentin like hates when I wear. Well, here's the thing. It's not even like lip plumping stuff. It's like if. She kissed me and I went into Equinox and my, I had a kiss mark on my cheek. It was no, like, but my... he freaks out. Like if I literally will, I will have Glossier like mint chapstick, like lip balm, like not spicy. And he freaks out and says it's spicy. Yeah. Guys, we made the best pizza ever. Was I vlogging that day? I don't think so. Anyway, no, no, yeah, I was, I was. But I don't think I talked about the pizza. So we good. made pizza from home and it was so freaking good. What are indicators that a boy is not toxic slash good for you, etc.? I think maybe. Yeah, that was really good. But I was gonna say maybe like reframe the question. <laughs> um, yeah, that's actually really good. I think if someone is toxic, in most in instances, I feel like they're not consistent. Like they'll say they're gonna do something and they don't. Like they'll act one way and then they're on the other side. That's of the literally spectrum. the answer. That's so good. Or. Um, I also think if someone wants to be with you, they're gonna be with you. Nine times out of ten. True. Yeah, excuses and stuff like like flaky, but also if like every day is like a bad day, or it's always someone else's problem, or or they or are all their exes. The yeah, or all their exes are crazy. Yeah, then like they might the be crazy, you know, because you're like, uh, you know. They don't have to be on maybe the best terms with their ex, but like, if they're always saying that they're crazy and all this different stuff, you're like, mm, like don't know. you don't have to love your ex and be like they're just the best person ever by any means. But it's like I think it also shows maturity to just be like, yeah, so it didn't work out. Like the people who are like, you know, oh, that was really good. You're good at this. Thank you. Okay, what is your favorite thing about me? And then I'll just do your favorite thing about you. But since you're eating, I'll do my favorite we, thing we about answered, you. I answered that on the IG live, so now it's your answer, turn. No, you can answer another one too, though. You said you were talking about me. I will do yours, but you can do mine too. Um, okay, actually, I would say my favorite thing about you is that you're normally very consistent. You are very consistent. I don't know why I said normally very consistent. You are consistent. Yes. <laughs> yes. Um, I always say this, but like, there's a lot of things, but there's some things that like, you can be like your eyes or your hair or different stuff like that, but... You never say like that stuff ever. Yeah, because every... I mean like... No, not that it's a bad thing to say like you would never say that. Yeah, I mean, because like a lot of people can have good hair or like, oh, your eyes are like pretty or unique. But I, I like that you're really like... One thing is grounded. You can't like teach that. Like, so like... Hi, like... Whatever a good deal comes your way or if it's like you a deal falls out or like friendship or family or whatever it is like nothing really like i guess like rocks you or throws you way off like you just stay grounded like you're just like okay like you know grounded like what is this like a flying saucer yeah with cheat with like pizza Ooh. saucer you know oh Ooh, that's good um thank you all right guys so that is it for today's vlog hope you guys enjoyed subscribe if you guys have not already Follow me on Instagram. I'm gonna eat my pizza and watch Tiger King. So, we're not giving you a Tiger King update, I guess, because we're just now watching it. It's like 9 p.m. But, I hope you guys enjoy. I'm gonna keep the vlogs up. I'm probably gonna film a favorites video, like current obsessions. I just feel weird about filming those videos right now because, like, you know, just weird. Anyways, love you guys and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.